Hello, my name is Andy Smith. I'm a technical director with Motioneering. Today I'm going to talk about the I-74 vehicle bridge across the Mississippi River. During wind tunnel testing of the I-74 vehicle bridge, it was found that during the construction of the arches that support the deck, that they would be susceptible to wind-induced vibration. So Motioneering was brought in to assess the damping required and we found we needed a very flexible system that would go down to 0.3 Hertz up to 0.76 Hertz. Uh, final design it had a two two and a half ton masses on each side of a frame. As the arch grew we could crank the spring beam, change the elevation and change the frequency on the fly. It was necessary to address the wind induced vibration to protect the arches during construction and mitigate the risk. Uh, any high amplitudes that could be achieved might damage the arches and cause uh, setbacks in the construction phase. Uh, the use of the tune mass dampers allowed the contractor to proceed with the design with good risk mitigation controls in place and ensure that the project went ahead on schedule and on budget. 